coverage you can count on continues with Sarah Schaefer. In less than a month, you will head to the polls to not only decide the next president, but also a number of state and local seats. And to help you get to know the people behind the campaign, we will do a series of interviews called Meet the Candidates all month long. This morning, we're talking about the Democratic side for Indiana's House. We're joined by candidate Bob Haddad. Thank you for being here, Bob. Good to have you. Thanks for having me. So first, let's start with your teacher. Um, talk about where you teach. Absolutely. I uh, teach at New Tech Academy at Wayne High School. Been there for the past three years. It's a great place to be. What do you teach there? I teach uh, a lot of different things, uh, whatever they tell me to. <laughs> so I teach um, electronic music, AP U.S. history, current events, Very cool. um, and financial planning. Very cool. You've got a mix of everything in there. Yeah. And I know that you want to get rid of I-STEP testing. Why? Uh, it's uh, wasteful as far as our state budget is concerned. Um, it's not representative, meaning teachers aren't at the table when these uh, questions are being developed. Uh, and they're not instructive. Uh, tests are designed to be a tool, not the end game. Um, and so whenever you have something like a standardized test, you want to be able to look at the scores at least to decide what you do later. Okay. like how you correct course or how you improve on a certain area but we don't get that turnaround in the past couple of years it's been just a complete waste of money and time okay so. I know you're also passionate about uh, ecological uh, topics um, what do you think about projects like the green rooftops and uh, things along those lines I like to see more of that development downtown I, I think um, the new uh, economic development projects downtown have started in that direction, I would be a definite yes vote for more funding, more grants uh, to provide businesses uh, green rooftops. Uh, we got to take care of our climate, we got to take care of our um, ecological footprint because our kids are going to inherit it and I don't think it should be you know a wasteland when they get to it so sure. that's one way we can do it. Okay, Bob why do you want to represent the 81st district? Well I live there I see what's happening and I feel like we can do better um, and so that's why I'm running. I, I think I could uh, represent folks um, better than they're currently being represented which I've heard from a lot of uh, constituents and they don't feel like they're being heard at all. So in this election cycle you know there's a lot of us teachers running and we represent students and families every day, so we would continue to do that at the State House. Okay, well, thank you, Bob, for coming on here, and it's good to get to know you a little bit. Yeah. We'll put this on our website so you can see it later. If you missed any of it, best of luck to you. Thank you.